Hi everybody. You probably wonder where I've been. <laughs> it's been a while since I released a video. Things have been really busy at work, and they're going to continue to be busy for at least another month. But I assure you, I have been messing around here on the bench a little bit with the uh, with this amplifier, and I have been shooting clips along the way, which we're going to have to put together and get edited. And uh, some very interesting things, so we'll see that pretty soon. I'm using my little mini handheld camera, so if the video is a little bit shaky, that's why. Uh, because I want to show you something. The other reason that I have not been posting videos is I've been busy with something else. And I'll back up here and let you see it. Yeah, we got some new shelving put in. So... With my spare time, I've been working on this, and the reason that this all transpired is beyond I really have needed to do it, is if you look at these shelves, the uh, my next door neighbor works at one of the local universities, and the actual college that she works at decided to remodel the library. You know how libraries are changing now because nobody's using books, <laughs> everything's online. So they tore out a whole bunch of their bookshelves. And you can see this is solid. Some of it is oak and some of it, like this part, is hard maple. It's all really high quality lumber. And they were throwing out a whole bunch of it. So I got a good bit of it for free. And along with some scrap lumber and what I had around, I just didn't want to get any money into this. I built this shelving. And you can see it's kind of custom made around my speakers. I added a switch that I've really needed for a while now and some fuses to protect the speakers. And now we can switch between our bench amplifier, the little class D, and the test sockets where we, you know, when we test amplifiers on the bench. So we can switch back and forth, which is really cool. I got all my transistors and capacitors and resistors organized and put up on these shelves. Now this is only some of what I have, but this is the most commonly used things that we use on the bench. I have a lot of other things on the other side of the basement stored, but uh, this stuff's nice because it's right next to the bench now. We're only about halfway done with the project, and you can kind of see more of the shelving and the resistors, but this built-in countertop with these drawers this is eventually also going to get totally cleared off and I'm going to set up my Hickok tube tester my triplet transistor analyzer and a few other pieces on top of this bench and make this like a component testing bench uh, and then have some extra storage down here so that's yet to come so I will be spending a little more time on that yet uh, and like I said, coming back to this, I have quite a bit of footage that I took. And as soon as I get this to a working point on this other channel, we're having some problems with. We had to do some troubleshooting. Once I get that done, I'll get the video stitched together and get it posted. And that should be before too long here. You'll be seeing that. So I just want to let you all know I'm still here. Everything's going well, although it's been really busy. Uh, I guess busy is a good thing, right? So... Until then, I wish you all peace, joy, happiness, and good health in your lives. We'll be seeing you real soon, and uh, I look forward to getting back on this project with you. Take care, everybody, and stay well. Bye-bye.